work and the topic of work is sort of a source of um, not only dignity but also identity to people and tackling the 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 issue of really sort of integrating people into workplaces and um, opportunity if you want so giving giving people a perspective Skill Lab is a social venture based in Amsterdam that is building AI-based uh, skill profiling software that's designed to help uh, employment service and training institutions to help provide career orientation and services to marginalized communities that are struggling to orient themselves and integrate into local labor markets. So we work with a, a whole host of different uh, partners, including public employment services, private employment services, nonprofits serving marginalized communities all over the world, uh, training institutions, vocational training institutions and universities, as well as e-learning providers, uh, all with the purpose of using uh, our artificial intelligence-based skill profiling software to help them to uh, collect information and data about uh, people's skills on a very granular level uh, in order to really grasp on a, on a detailed level what somebody's past experiences uh, and skills that they've, and knowledge that they've learned entails. You can not only translate skills on the level of language, but you can also translate them um, in, in terms of what they mean. And also seeing how those skill set then map to existing uh, industries, sectors, and careers uh, in local labor markets in order to facilitate um, better employment outcomes uh, and education outcomes for individuals that are typically excluded from traditional uh, labor market practices. So some of the communities that we serve tend to be refugees, migrants, and asylum seekers, uh, as well as mature workers that have experienced uh, a shock to their careers. If you're fortunate, if you're losing your job or you, you're having sort of problems to orient yourself and you have Good friends, you're privileged enough to have a network, maybe your friends who sit down and say, hey, have you considered this? Or did you think about how, how much you sort of uh, enjoyed doing another thing or were good at, at doing this or that? I think that's really sort of what, what we're very indirectly, but but from on the meter level, so to speak, are striving for is sort of democratizing the access to to good advice. <laughs>